Welcome to a virtual video tour of OPL's newly renovated and revitalized Rosemount branch. I'm Danielle McDonald, CEO of the Auto Public Library. Je vous invite à visiter la succursale nouvellement restaurée de Rosemount. Ottawa Public Library's Rosemount branch celebrated its 100th anniversary in 2018, and it is the last remaining Carnegie Library in Ottawa. That year of Rosemount's centennial, hundreds of residents and OPL customers gave their ideas for innovations and improvements to better meet community needs. That public input is reflected throughout the revitalized branch that I am delighted to walk you through today. The first thing visitors will notice when they see the branch is the new lantern reading room. We'll take a closer look at this from the inside. The front also has new sleek signage for the branch's address. There's a new book return on the side of the building that checks in returns as soon as they are dropped off at the branch. The branch is in such a fantastic location, easily accessible by bike, by foot, by bus, and many other means of transport. Here we have the courtyard with seating and new stroller parking. It's a great space for having a chat, meeting a friend, or taking in the sun with a good book. The branch has been designed to meet the latest accessibility standards. Here is the new accessible door operator. Thanks to Kitchissippi Ward Councillor Jeff Leeper for his enthusiasm and support for Rosemount's revitalization, and also for cutting the ribbon. This is where people can access the elevator, the program room, meeting room, and the washrooms. And we'll visit these spaces later in the tour after seeing the changes upstairs. Here's the main room in Rosemount. We've kept the original beautiful beams in the ceiling as many community members told us how much they enjoy the historic ambiance. Les clients de Rosemount nous ont fait savoir qu'il serait important de conserver des éléments originaux et historiques comme on l'a fait ici dans la salle principale. We also replaced the windows with new energy-efficient ones that replicate the historic look of the original windows. Let's head over to see the lantern reading room from the inside. This new lantern reading room really enhances the public space by offering more seating and also provides a dramatic presence on the street, a welcoming beacon into the branch. The glass used in the lantern is bird-friendly and contains hidden words in both English and French. Les gens de n'importe quel âge auront le plaisir de trouver les mots gravés dans la vitre de ce nouvel espace de lecture éclairé. The original wall shelves have been refreshed and are still being used. We've added modern white shelving throughout the branch. Some of it is on wheels to create a flexible space. The service hub is where you can find helpful OPL staff. The hanging plexiglass shield was installed due to the ongoing pandemic. And here are some study tables. I love this corner reading nook. The public computer stations have been split into two groups that are spaced out so customers can enjoy their computer time without disturbing their neighbors. One group is by the stairs and the other with an assistive station is over by the elevator. Here you can consult the OPL catalog or print your documents. An area specially for teens was on the public wish list. Here is the new area where teens can study or read. Nous espérons que les adolescents se sentiront bien ici. Cet espace est pour eux. There was also strong interest from the community in having a new piece of public art. Hintenberg artist Daniel Martelock created this work called Launch in collaboration with the children from the Rosemount area. It now hangs here in the children's room. The artist replicated the children's airplane designs in metal and suspended them from the ceiling as though flying through the air. The artwork represents imagination, taking off and flying with help from the library. Windows that were covered up in the last renovation in 1983 were opened up again to let in more natural light. Grâce à la rénovation, voyez ici toute la lumière naturelle. We've included lots of seating. This reading nook is furnished with beloved chairs from the old branch. Downstairs again, here's the new meeting room that can be booked by local groups once the pandemic is over. New and improved washrooms have been upgraded. There's even a universal, all-gender washroom that has a height-adjustable, adult-size change table. 
Here you can see the programming room ready for story time. This space can also be booked by community groups when it is not in use for library programming. Voici la salle des programmes toute prête pour l'heure du compte. Another window gives you a peek behind the scenes of the library. This is where staff would process items coming into and going out of the branch. Here you see the entrance to the staff area, the accessibility lift, as well as an emergency exit that leads to the public courtyard outside. This concludes our tour of the newly renovated Rosemount branch. I wish to offer special thanks to Rosemount employees, other OPL and city employees who are instrumental in helping with all these changes. We also wish to thank the Odawa Centre, the Parkdale Food Centre, and the Somerset West Community Health Centre, and many other community partners and neighbours. Sincere thanks to FOPLA, the Friends of the Ottawa Public Library Association, for the furniture inside the branch. We now have a remarkable and beautiful branch that reflects its dynamic community and is ready for the future. Vous êtes tous les bienvenus à venir nous visiter en personne. À bientôt. Come see us in person soon.